The data in the figure below represents the number of stars earned by 140 performers in a talent competition. So notice along the horizontal axis, we have the number of stars earned, and notice the vertical axis is not the number of performers, it's the percent of performers earning a particular number of stars. Our question is how many performers earned exactly four stars? Well notice here's four on the horizontal axis, which represents the number of stars, and based upon the height of this bar, we can determine that five percent of the performers earned four stars. So to answer the question, we want to determine what is five percent of 140. There are several ways to answer this question. Whenever determining the percent of a number though, we can convert the percent to a decimal and multiply. So to convert five percent to a decimal, we drop the percent sign and move the decimal point to the left two places. Or if we want, we can drop the percent sign and divide by 100. Notice five divided by 100 does give us 0 0.05 or 0 0.05. So we'd have 0 0.05 and then times 140 of means multiplication. This product will give us five percent of 140. So 0 0.05 times 140 is equal to seven. Which means seven performers earn four stars. But let's also answer this question more formally using a percent equation as well as a percent proportion. So using a percent equation, we use these keywords to set up our equation where is means equals, of means multiplication, and what, what number, or what percent represents the unknown, so we write down a variable. So looking at our question here, the first word is what, so we write down a variable, let's use x. Is means equals, we know five percent as a decimal is 0 0.05, of means multiplication, and then we have 140, and notice how this product is the same product we have here, and therefore we know x equals seven, giving us the same result. And now using the percent proportion, we can use keywords is over of equals p over 100, but this is really setting up two ratios where we compare the part to the whole and the percent to 100. So because we're looking for the part of 140 that earned four stars, our first ratio would be the unknown x to 140 must be equal to the percent compared to 100, and since we have five percent, it would be five to 100. And now we cross multiply and solve for x. So x times 100 must equal 140 times five. X times 100 is 100x. 140 times five is equal to 700, dividing both sides by 100. We get the same result, x equals seven. So here are three ways we can determine the percent of a number. I hope you found this helpful.